As thousands flee raging wildfires in Alberta, some are discovering the damage the fire has dealt to the lives they left behind. We're just shell-shocked right now. Adam Norris fled his Drayton Valley area home earlier this week. He describes the moment fire crews knocked on his door telling him, his wife, and his grandson to get out. Uh, by the time I backed my RV trailer out from behind the trees and put it on the road, the giant fireball was already in the yard. He was allowed to return once after the fire was initially beaten back, but while he was home gathering medications and other precious personal items, the unthinkable happened. It flared again. He had just moments to flee once more. Literally went from a black cloud a kilometer away to the fire was in our yard in like less than guaranteed less than five minutes. Now, as these images show, he's learned the fire destroyed his cars, a barn full of work equipment, a trailer, and more. And underscoring just how hard these fires are to extinguish, the second flare-up also destroyed the home he thought had been spared. But it's just been a roller coaster. It was like, yeah, it's good. No, it's bad. Yeah, it's good. No, it's bad. Yeah, it's good. Oh, it's gone. Norris and his family were evacuated to the Edmonton area, where an emergency reception center has been set up to help those who find themselves suddenly homeless from the fire. There they'll wait to hear when they can go back to see what remains.